Welcome to Beer Stories and this short mini-series on the Float Wi-Fi hydrometer. In this series of video I'll show you how to connect it to the Wi-Fi and the BrewBrain uh, uh, backend, BrewFather, um, yeah, and calibrate and all sorts of things. In this video I'll show you how to connect it to uh, the BrewFather app. Um, that's really handy uh, when you put it in your, uh, your fermenter. It will send information to brew farther on uh, on the gravity, and you can follow your your brew live. So that's uh, that's cool. Um, yeah, but uh, all you have to do is log into your brew brain profile, and uh, and go down here on the user panel. And down in here, you can see your username. You can change your password and so on. But what you have to do is uh, over here. Enable the integration, just like that. And now you have to go into uh, BrewFather, Settings. In the settings, you will find the BrewBrain Float Hydrometer. Activate that. Copy the ID number down here. Go back to uh, BrewBrain. and uh, go into uh, your integrations, set up a new integration. Integration name is BrewFather, like that. It's Beer Storage Float 1, yeah. Copy the ID number, approve integration, and click set integration. And that's it. Yeah, and that's it. My uh, my BrewBrain float is now connected to BrewFather, and I can uh, I can see interaction with my uh, my float and the measurements uh, in the fermentation tank in BrewFather and follow the brew live in there. Yeah, so that's it. If you like the video, please click like, subscribe to my uh, YouTube channel, or uh, just follow me on Instagram and Facebook. That would make me really happy. Other than that, well, if you have any questions, write them in the comments or write to me elsewhere. Um, and just have a happy brewing out there.